We are at Toronto, the University of Toronto's self-driving car team participating in the SAE Auto Drive Challenge. This is our autonomous vehicle, Zeus. Over the past four years, we have retro retrofitted a Chevy Bolt EV with a sensor suite to achieve autonomous driving capability. Our vehicle has four black fly cameras, a Velodyne 64 line LiDAR, an Anaplanix GNSS system on the roof rack, and a Continental radar system in the front grille. To process all the sensor information and plan corresponding action, we utilize an Intel Crystal Rugged server in the trunk. As we prepare for the final year competition, our vehicle can now work as an autonomous ride sharing vehicle under controlled environments. Let's take a ride on our test track. Obeying traffic signage and driving like a normal human is critical for the safety of autonomous vehicles. Our vehicle is able to distinguish and handle different kinds of traffic signage. For example, here there's a roadblock ahead due to construction. Our vehicle is able to perceive that and intelligently reroute its path to detour the area. There are multiple agents on the road in urban driving, and together they compose a complex environment. Keeping ourselves and others safe is very important. For example, here our vehicle observes a pedestrian at a crosswalk having the right of way to cross. Our car will slow down and safely yield to the pedestrian. In the event of a ped pedestrian jaywalking, our planner predicts the trajectory of the pedestrian and makes a safe decision. While cameras are able to provide rich semantic information, sometimes the environment lighting might hinder our camera detection capabilities. In these conditions, our LiDAR will become our primary sensor for perception. To further ensure safety, we have an independent emergency stopping system that utilizes radar to detect any imminent objects around the vehicle. In urban areas, GPS signals can suffer from blockage or multi-pass reflection around buildings and trees. To address this issue, our vehicles also has its separate LiDAR SLAM system that utilizes 3D point cloud information to localize itself and build a map of the environment simultaneously. We encourage our students to develop their software following Automated Vehicle Safety Consortium's best practice guidelines. All new developments are thoroughly tested before integrating into the production pipeline. Let's say we would like to introduce a feature that allows the vehicle to detect and react to a stop sign. We follow the V-Model lifecycle for development. Our stakeholders first define and agree upon features requirement, desired behavior, and success metrics. Next, the simulation team will create MathWorks simulating scenarios and test the newly added feature in the fully integrated system. Once the developer completes a feature implementation, they will unit test it first and then submit it to all Toronto's auto evaluator testing pipeline. Our pipeline will run the software stack against the simulation scenarios and generate a report with all metrics' performance. The development team will review the test results and improve the implementation. If all the metrics requirement is achieved, the feature will be tested on our vehicle with our safety driver on our test track. When the behavior is confirmed correct, the feature is accepted and merged into production. Our future work will focus on improving our system's robustness and safety on the more complex driving scenarios. For example, adding additional sensors to enhance perception coverage, developing more sophisticated behavior prediction algorithms for crowded urban environments, and integrating a dynamic vehicle model in the controller for safer driving under harsh road conditions. Autonomous driving systems have many inherent advantages. Compared to a human driver, computers produce more consistent behavior and faster reaction speed. Typically, a human driver's reaction time is 1.3 seconds when an incident occurs. On the other hand, our system can react to an emergency in just 0.2 seconds. We believe more autonomous vehicles on the road can drastically reduce the preventable accidents caused by human drivers. At Altrondo, we believe that autonomous driving technology is a crucial part of the future. 
and we are proud to work with the industry pioneers and train students to reshape and enhance the safety of transportation.